Hey guys, Bredo here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to a brand new game which has just dropped officially, Kingdom Come Deliverance. So it's made by Warhorse Studios, of course. It's taken a long time to develop this game, but this game looks absolutely bloody amazing. Let's get straight straight into it. Let's get stuck in. Some of you might not know about the game, but it's a medieval game where you start off as a character and um, the storyline will continue from there pretty much. Hopefully I don't have to read this. You guys can read it. This game looks absolutely stunning. Graphics are set to full everything. If you guys are wondering what sort of PC I have, it's in the description below. Um, I run a GTX 1080. We've got two of those, but I only run one, I think. So, a very, very expensive PC. Take a few screenshots here. Just for future reference for maybe medieval engineers. So you can't put water and stuff in, but we do some interesting buildings. It's like a mine there. Yep, there we go. It's like a, a VIP, very important person. Hopefully the sound's okay. I did turn the sound down a little bit just to make sure, but that was pretty loud, that bit of music. God bless. Same to you. Today's a scorch. <laughs> Graphics look bloody amazing. Horse down there eating away. Coming up on the blacksmith, which is um, our father. Our father's a blacksmith. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. We are Henry. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour, blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening. Drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. So the graphics are just great. Background graphics, their faces, the, the way they talk, the way things move, it all looks, you know, pretty realistic. Looks great. Henry! Get up now. There's work to be done. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slug of bed. <laughs> Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Uh-oh. Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. <laughs> A little bit cranky this morning. Alright, so I haven't played this game before guys, so you have to bear with me a little bit. First quest, Unexpected Visits. A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Okay, so by means of the first two choices in this dialogue, you will select your character's default characteristics. 
If you're not satisfied with them, not to worry. All characters can be further developed without limitations. Um, we were chatting in the tavern, dancing um, agility. I was with Bianca, Vitality. I was working in the forge. We weren't working in the forge, so we were chatting in the tavern. Mm, nothing much. Me and the lads were just having a chat in the tavern. Some wayfarer stopped by. He was telling us what's going on in the world, and, um, well, I, uh, I lost track of time. Well, I hope you didn't fill your head with nonsense. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. There's a new level in speech, and a new main level. scratch on your hand, and that suspicious-looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Uh, why would I be interested in sword fighting speech? Matthias was teaching me uh, archery. Or was it Bianca, or what does that matter? Strength, I think. So I'm learning to sword fight, and what of it? What harm does it do? At least I'll be able to defend myself. God above, Hal. You know how your father will react when he finds out. How? What's he going to do? I'm doing nothing wrong. I just wanted to try it. On your own head be it, then. I can't stop you, and you can deal with your father on your own. Don't come looking to me for help. Deal. Um, go to your father. So have my friends been here? Matthew and Fritz come looking for me. No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't okay. be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Um. My friends Matthew aren't drunks. Matthew and Fritz aren't drunkards. I never said they were, did I? And if I really minded you going for a beer with them, I'd have put a stop to it long ago. I was young once too, you know. And your father was no angel when he was in Kuttenberg. Uh, give me an example. Yes, wasn't. <laughs> you don't believe me? Ask him yourself. All right, I will. You're not a boy anymore, Henry. You're a man, and it's time to start acting like one. Yesterday you promised your father you'd help at the forge. If you made yourself useful now and then, I wouldn't mind your mischief making so much. Um, I'm hungry. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. I think your ma is pa angry, angry at me. angry with me for sleeping late. He's not happy. Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Sir Radzik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. But he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. He oh, always has next? his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Uh, do you need help? You need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. Alright, well, end dialogue, I think. So we can have for breakfast. Oh, there's some cheese. Can pick up some cheese. Oh. We must have moved it away, so he didn't want to pick it up. Hmm, some apples. We'll grab some apples. Um, I didn't read any of that set up in the top right-hand corner then. Can we get this other one? There we go. What else is there? What's in... Nothing in the bag. We can sit. We can grab a bread roll. Take this for later, just in case... Oh, I don't know why we can't reach that far. Oh, nearly head butt at the table at the same time. Pick up the lentil soup. Um, can we grab these other apples? There we go. Uh, what else have we got around? Nothing else. Heat from pot. There we go. No longer hungry, which is good. Anything, any other food there? No. Can we open a chest? Nails for Teresa. Uh, we'll take all. I guess. What have we got in here? Nothing exciting. Open this other door. Oh, we've got heaps of stuff in here. Onions. We'll take all of those. Take all the carrots. All the cabbages. Hopefully our parents don't mind that we're stealing from them. Bread, uh, what's in there? Oh wow, bread, onion, beets. 
Nothing in that one. Must be like a joint bag, I think. Oh, nothing there either. Um, 15 apples, we'll take all of those. We can lockpick it. We don't have a lockpick. Um, cabbage and carrots. Some more apples. I wonder why when we click on it, it the bag changes. What else is there? That must be the shelf that we're clicking on. So that's it. We've got grabbed heaps of stuff. Um, player. So we did go up a main level. So we can go up in our strength, agility, vitality, or speech. I think we might um, go up in speech. Uh, noise. Um, our states. I wonder what all this stuff is. Might be something we have to. Uh. Does that mean we can. I said we went up one. It's a grave digger. Could have told you what it actually was. Stronghold? Uh, yes. Um, tight grip, head cracker, heavy swing. Let's go heavy. Oh, we can't learn that one. Uh, I wonder if we can. No, we can't learn anything else. So maybe that was. Might have used something else. Um, can't learn any of these things. So. It's our current level. Our level progress. And perk points. So combat. Can change things. Skills. Actually, we'll go back into here. Q info, there we go. Carrying dead or unconscious bodies won't cost you any stamina and they will burden you only half as much. Oh, okay. Skills, buffs, reputation statistics, um, quest logs, inventory. We've got door keys, we've got a green shirt, trunk keys, plenty of stuff on us. No weapons. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here. Whoop. This way. So you'll see down the bottom. Um, if we if we run, you'll see our stamina bar drops. The yellow one and our red one must be our health. We have discovered a grindstone. Which can we go to map? Um, go to your father. Go to the sword fighting lesson. Oh, okay. Thought it might have come up with um what things were. Uh, no, we don't want a marker. What's that? Skulllets. Okay, exit. So is there... There's not as a grindstone that I can see anywhere. What's it meant here? We can't use any of this stuff. Alright, let's talk to Father. It's going to be pretty cranky at us, I think. What's the matter with you, Henry? Didn't you hear me calling you? Okay, persuasion. Sometimes you need powers of persuasion to achieve your goals. When talking to people, you can choose what kind of impression you want to make on them. You can sp simply use speech, which, however, is influenced by the reputation you have at the moment with the person you're talking to. In the Middle Ages, social status was paramount, so the quality of your attire and well groomed you are together with your reputation can make a big difference. Uh, if you look dangerous, people will be afraid to cross you and be more willing to assign risky tasks to you. Um, it's influenced mainly by your strength and effect of your weapons and equipment. Blood stains on their clothes help as well. You can sometimes rely on money to do the talking for you. Um, in special cases, you can try any of Henry's other skills, for example, horsemanships. horsemanship. Uh, but different approaches work on different people. You won't intimidate a tough brawler easily, and no matter how well you dress, you won't impress the nobility easily. That's because Henry's ability aren't simply assigned a universal value, but compared with the abilities of his counterpart. 
You can see the values of the various abilities in the game under the corresponding icons. You can always see your own abilities, your counterpart's abilities are visible to you if it's someone you know well or if you're skilled at reading people. Learn the perk Empathetic. It's the amount of gold we got have to pay. Our speech level, charisma skill and strength skill. Um, it's not about the stats, it's an influence about reputation, dirty or bleeding. If you can't outdo the nimble tongue of a merchant, for example, you may want to poison him a little first and then he'll be easier to persuade. Or if you lead a guard away from his friends, he'll be easier to scare. Okay. Um, uh, sorry. Sorry, Father. I was taking a stroll and lost track of time. Somehow I had a feeling I was seeing everything for the first time. Because he was drunk. How, my boy? When are you going to get some sense? <laughs> anyway, we've a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money, then. Yeah, you saw all the apples the that we thing. stole. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh, all right. not drunker. <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure will be happy to hear <laughs> Sounds it. Sounds like fun. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasal. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. Alright. Most of the quests can be completed in different ways. Eloquence will help you with his friends, an inconspicu inconspicuous person can totally avoid trouble. And if you'd rather not beat around the bush, violence can also be a solution. So, new codex entry. Up with quests and journals, okay. Now we need to work out where we're going. I think if we go up here, might be able to grab um, the bit we need for Sir Radzik's sword. Um, look to Jaroslav, I think that was his name. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Very well. Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzik, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and grip. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to Beautiful. see Beautiful. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? <sighs> Where shall I start? <laughs> ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Beautiful. That was easy. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. Graphics That's are bloody great. Might even be on me. Cross guard. Okay, let's go and have a look. Can we find it? There we go. Can we look at it? No, we can't see how beautiful it is. Um, Codex. Town garrison. Don't need to go reading all this stuff, but okay. We got the cross guard at the castle's completed, so now we have to head down. Through here you can see at the top we've got A and C, so there's a few tasks up there we need to get. Guys, grabbing some hay out of his wagon there. You'll find all the information about the quest in the log, and for clarity they are also indicated on the map, as well as on the compass at the top of the screen. Okay. Indeed I am, or I'll have nothing to smelt the ore with, and the king won't get his silver. <laughs> Which king do you mean, Master Tobias? 
The one sitting in some godforsaken. Is he still on the charcoal, or is this guy still on the charcoal? To the dungeon. These are strange times. It's good to see him talking. Um, talk. But since I serve our liege lord Sarazic, I can see through this. Good health to you. Let's talk trade. So we want charcoal. How many do we want? Do we want 50? You pay 25 gold. Can we... Oh, we can sell. There we go. Marrow gold decoction. In one minute, we'll cure light wounds or dispel hangover effects. Got some cheese. Um, we're going to need to sell a lot of stuff to buy that, aren't we? We've got 52 apples, which only going to give us yeah, not even 5 gold, I don't think. Um, yeah, so we want to exit the shop. We don't want to buy that yet. We want to head over. Yeah, well, there's a trader discovered. Are these things coming up on the map? That's a question. Yep, trader. Charcoal. Um, what's B? Sword fighting and ale from the tavern. Okay, this is where we need to collect the stuff from Kunesh, which I think we end up in a fist fight. Can we? No, we can't knock out the chickens. Hello, Kunesh. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? Oh, that's not very nice. Father sent me for the money. Father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Pay for the tools at least. I know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Um. Steps must be paid. I don't think we have. Yeah, we'll try it. Look, I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off. Booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt, and I can't leave here without something. You son of a whore! How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No. Well, I'll teach you then. Well, so here comes a fist fight. Alright, so Slash is our left mouse. Um, slower strike with weapon. Slower hand strike to the head. Um, right is a stab or a jab. Okay, so hook or a jab. F is a kick. Um, Q is to block. Stamina, health. Our wounds, opponent. Okay, done. Ooh. Whatever he said. Oh. Come on, buddy. Ooh. Getting too close to him. You hosen. Oh, he moved. Shit. Oh, I thought I was going to kick him then. We're out of stamina. Oh. Oh, come on, we're blocking. We're stuck you somewhere. What for? Sod it! Oh, get out of it, you bastard! Is that trying to die for that? Trying to like. Block and counter punch, but it's not really working, is it? Oh, I'm not very good at fighting. Sod. 
Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Going for a big hook then. Oh. You call that combat? I'm trying. Come on, jab, kick, something. Oh, come on. Oh. You had it coming, you pup. You little bastard. Oh, language. That's it. Can we? Oh, he's trying to punch on with him then. Enough for you, but you still owe my father. Hmm. You get nothing from me. Tell that to your old man. Okay. I'm telling you, lay one finger on me, and I'll have you thrown in jail. Oh. Come on, mate. Yeah, that's all I've got. You're just lucky. Not sure how he's moving away so quick, but. I keep pressing Q to block him, but it's not working. Bloody hell! This will be interesting. Every time I go to block, he still comes in with a bloody knee. Ah, there we go. Oh. Come on, have a swing. This is going to be quick. Oh, don't hit the guard. Oh, get out of it. Who's the guard? Is he still still standing right next to us? I think he's gonna kill us. Come on, let's knock him out. Whatever that means. Oh, we're nearly dead. Oh, there we go, we're dead, I think. Oh, we should have walked away. You bastard. Can you guys sort him out or what? Let's go, let's go to mum. Mum, you help us. Obviously not very good at fighting, am I? Bloody terrible. So we need to go. I th yeah, I think so. Not sure what those things are down the bottom. Bottom left is obviously our yeah, clothes. Bottom right is like our head or something. Ma. Ah, ma. I'm hurt. You won't stop bleeding. Oh, now, stop squealing like a baby and show me that. <laughs> there you are, good as new. You ought to learn to do that yourself. Thanks, Ma. To do what? 
Ooh, she'll patch us up. We're still sort of half bloody dead. Let's um, let's eat some bread. Go back for a second attempt, or what? Um, so sneak. Okay, I think there's a way we can knock him out. If we sneak, we can. Knock him out, I think. At least need to keep an eye on these guards. There we go. Knock him out. Oh no. Sorry. Didn't mean it. Forgot I was even here. Um, wash myself. That's really what we need to do because we're bloody filthy. Where is his door to his house? Maybe we can steal some stuff from inside. He's still standing there. Can we open? Aha! Um, people don't like to go where not. They'll warn you at first, but if you're caught in the castle guardhouse, for example, you risk immediate arrest. Can we get in here? It's nothing. Well, he's got a pretty shitty house. There's nothing in here at all. Hmm. Ooh, we can drop something into the pot. Hmm. A locked chest. I'll need a lock pick to get into that. Fritz might have one. He might. Let's um, pretend that we're not doing anything. Can we knock him out? I don't think he wants to talk. Where's his axe? Is it still there? It's on the ground there, I think. Ha! Stole your axe. What else do we need? His axe and hammer and nails. I don't know where his hammer and nails are. Might be in his pocket. Let's go to Kunash and not Kunash. Um, Fritz. Are they over here? It's probably them. Hey, Pit. Do you want to learn something? Combat master. No. no. Not right now. So. Talk to the gambler. Where's uh, buy ale from the tavern. Uh, bag of charcoal, the gambler, where's Fritz? They're probably at the tavern, aren't they? That's the tailor. Uh, blacksmith. Food. Where's the tavern? Must be here. There you go. Well, we are clean, pretty clean now. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts, traitors. Now even the Pope God be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. Well, these guys are arguing in it for a fight in a minute. Deutsche Spalten shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. Chicken's not happy. Austrians. And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Winston is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Winston commander in chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. 
South Bohemia is with Sigismund. And don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. <laughs> Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? The two are my view. Should give him a proper hiding. <sighs> are you mad? <laughs> do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlementure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? That's it, let's Count throw shit in his house. I'd rather torch it, to be honest. But, doing some turns will do. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for a father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Oh. Are you with us? With us or against us? Well, I need a lockpick first. I do, but I need your help in return. All right, I'll do it. But then you have to give me a hand with something. What do you need? Kuna shows money to father and doesn't want to pay. I tried talking to him, but he wouldn't listen. I need more than words to get coin out of him, and I can't handle it on my own. No problem. We'll back you up. Just as soon as we're done plastering Deutsch's house. I'll be happy to sort out that drunken oaf. All right. Let's go while Deutsch is still sitting safely in the tavern. Would have been better than us trying to knock him out ourselves because of bloody hopeless. Um, we'll follow these guys. That's his house there by the looks of it. Where's the big pile of poo? Or is that not it? You I'm sorry. Just looking around. Be a bit more careful. Listen, there's this locked chest I need to get into. Really? An only stray not good enough for you anymore? It's just that someone has something that doesn't belong to him, and I want to take it back. Sure. <laughs> if you say so. It's not skin off my nose anyway. I've got some lockpicks you can have. But if you get caught, you didn't get them from me. <laughs> Never heard of you. Thanks, Fritz. Alright, I've got four lockpicks. Come on, let's do this job. Get over and done with. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. Totally clever. Pick up the poop. You can talk to Duch's wife. What do you want, lad? Your husband's making I trouble. I just went by the tavern, and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right, and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exceptions, so I thought... God almighty! The fool! Next thing he'll start on about the popes! He might have mentioned the popes too. Thank you for telling me. <laughs> I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. Let's grab some poo. I want to pick it up. What are you waiting for, soldier? 
fire the trebuchet for king and country. For king and country, <laughs> my ass. This is all good, clean, fun. <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund. Woohoo! Eat shit, Doshus. You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? Uh oh. <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse Hans! I'll take those smites off your faces! Uh, Horse Hans? I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutsche? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Fucker! I'll make you pay for that! Uh oh. What are we gonna do now? I hope we don't have to fight again because it's hopeless. Uh oh. He's... I'm going to. In... <laughs> oh, his bloody knees and stuff. Come on, help me, mate. <laughs> My friend's right behind him, doing nothing. I want hit him. That's it. Now I can hit him too. <laughs> Did we knock him out? Yep, close enough. Ah. <laughs> Ooh. Where are these other guys going? Ooh. What are you doing? That's it. Run from the catch pole. I don't know where we're going, but we'll run. Right, sometimes you have to get a particular waypoint in a hurry if Henry has already been in a certain place to cover the whole journey again. And on the map, you can see the places you can fast travel to. Just select where you want to go and confirm. In other words, you can probably fast travel to there. That's where we are now. Ah, okay. We need to. Might buy some ale from the tavern on the way. Have we got any money though? Um. Where's our. I don't know. Other. Doesn't say we've got money. Let's go, player. So going up another level. A level in strength. Stronghold. Cost me 30% less stamina. You can carry 15 pounds more. Uh, tight grip. Headcracker. Heavy swing, uh, mule, what's dreadful? I think we need to go, um, clinch master. Not that we can learn that for some reason. Can't learn that either. Or that. Or anything there. Maybe it's our main level. Okay, there we go. Ascetic. Last two percent longer without food. Uh, Fifty percent more cruiser when talking to women. Night rider. Scouts. Wanderer. Ah, uh, okay. I think that one is probably the one to do. But we've got no other perk points, so I think that's right. Let's go to the tavern. This episode's taken a little while. Hopefully, she doesn't spot us. Good health to you, Henry. Um, who are you? Um, well, that's the lady we told to go and get a husband. I've only got two hands. Sorry, Bianca. It's our girlfriend. Go 
God save my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? Uh, ale. Just ale. What else could I expect from a village lout? <laughs> what will it be then, ragamuffin? Uh, a pitcher for father. I need ale for father. As the gentleman wishes. But wait though, there's a catch. I've no money. Kunesh owes me and he won't pay up. <sighs> Leave it to me. But you have to pay me back this evening. Oh, we'll pay you back all right. That's girl a man could wish for. <laughs> Your father wants a cool one from the cellar, doesn't he? Wait here while I fetch it. Oh, she's a good woman, isn't she? Here you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Don't worry, dearest. This evening I'll see you right. Oh, how? I do hope so. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty-looking fellow was asking after you. Vanyak. Vanyak. I suppose. He's a man who makes his coin rubbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Kiss on the cheek. Your favourite. Save your schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Save your schnapps. The game order saves from time to time important points in its quests. You must drink the potion to save your schnapps. You always have a maximum of three of your own save games. The oldest is overwritten. Ah, okay. We've already got all the is this... Yeah, Venyak, that's who it is. We'll have to go up here. Is that the dude we just had a fight with? Be a Who's bit that? More careful. No, not Kunesh. I already stole his axe anyway. Where is he? I guess he's already in. He must be inside already. Kunish didn't see us go in. I want to get into another bloody fight. Alright, let's go over here and try and lockpick. Um, locks, help, T. So, in order to pick the locks, you must have at least one lockpick in your inventory, although it's better to have one or two spares. Um, since they get worn with use and, in worst case, can break. Yeah. How close are you to the sweet spot is indicated by the size of the cursor. It turns gold when you find it. Then you have to use the lock pick D to turn the whole lock mechanism. At the same time, you have to coordinate the movement of the lock pick with the rotation of the mechanism because the rotation shifts the position of the sweet spot. If you try to turn the mechanism without having lock pick in the correct position, the mechanism will stick, will damage the lock pick, or even break it. Uh, yes, okay. So we need to go out, find. The sweet spot, which is where up oh, there. Press D. Oh, oops. Oops. There we go. Unlocked. Who's there? Uh oh. A thief. No. God. Punch him. Oh shit, run. Oh, dead end. Hey, you don't move a muscle. I'm not. Oh Jesus. What was that? Oh, I'm surrendering. Oh gee, you surrender. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this first episode hasn't gone according to plan. You were seen stealing. No, was it? 
You should have thought twice about what you were doing. That will land you a fat fine. What's your step? This is surely no way to treat one of Sir Radzig's men. I dread to think what he'll do when he finds out. Sure. And you think that makes you above the law? Think again. I don't have enough money. Well, it's a jail cell for you then. <laughs> Run again. Is he still chasing us? I can't tell. Probably is. What's going on there? Nothing. I'm running home. Oh god, he caught us again already. Shit. Now there's two of them. I'm going home. Where's mum? Here, dad, help. Somebody, okay, we'll surrender, 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 quick before we die again. <laughs> you were seen thieving. No. You should have thought twice about what you Who's were doing. Who's this other dude that's punching on with us? You up. Um. Oops. Let's run home. <laughs> oh well. We're gonna have to go to jail, I think. Not sure what's happening now with I have no idea what's going on. You were seen stealing. Who's this dude? This definitely Um Yeah this mm. success. This is surely no way to treat one of Sir Radzig's men. I dread to think what he'll do when he finds out. Ah, I didn't... I didn't know that. My apologies. Go ahead. Thank you. What about this other dude? Is he gonna... Oh, thank God for that. We might need to, um... Um... Get rid of the item info. Where's our... Save your snaps. Now we need this, don't we? Did we eat one? Oh, maybe we did that time. That hasn't done anything. Right, where's our bandages? There. Oh. Oh, okay, I have to learn first aid first. Well, we're halfway dead. Let's talk to Dad anyway. He's got everything in it. Actually, no, we haven't got bloody charcoal. Um, no. And dialogue, don't worry about it. Uh, what are we going to do now? Meet the lads at. Oh, that would have helped. Buy a bag of charcoal. We don't have any money yet, do we? I don't think. 60.5, we've got no gold. So, how are we going to get the gold we need? Oh, I don't know. Probably should have met the lads there first and then they're up there somewhere. Ah oh, well. I only need one bag of charcoal. Let's buy one bag. I'm not going to buy more than one. God Almighty. Let's talk trade. Um, yes, we want one. How much is that? Okay, 0 0.5. So if we sell you uh, one beat, call it even. Close it. Let's, let's haggle. Let's talk about the price. Why not? Okay. Uh, I think it works both ways whether you want to buy cheap or sell. Do you select the amount you want to pay or get W? And S and confirm with E. 
The trader will then respond to your offer. The answer is a refusal. He or she will make a counter offer. Okay. If the slider can't be moved in one direction or the other, it means either you or the trader does not have enough money. Dragging out the haggling one after another will gradually tr try the trader's patience and eventually they'll drop the haggling completely. You can see how close you are to getting to that point from the trader icon below. The more gold in there is in the background, the closer the traders are dropping the haggling. Okay. Um, let's go. E. No deal then. Oh, that didn't. That didn't work, did it? I'll have to try that another time, I think. Um, let's just grab one bag, sell one beat, and we'll close the deal. I'm not gonna. Ah, oh, we need nine more bags. Let's talk trade. Uh, I want to buy. Can we type nine? No. Nope. Nine. How much do we need for nine? Four fifty. Uh, we can sell that. We need four pounds. One of those, and we need one and a half. Um, so fifteen of these. Done. Not gonna haggle. That's it. Just buy a bag. We had to buy body ten. We should have said buy ten bags of charcoal. Alright, so here we go. Talk to father. That should be everything he wanted now, I hope. About time. Have you got, got everything, everything I wanted? wanted? Yes. I've got to go to a uh, I've got everything Kunish from Kunish. Pay, so I got no money for those things you sold him. But I took them in lieu of the debt. Took meaning he gave them to you, or took meaning stole. If you didn't pay, then they're still ours. How can you steal something that's yours? Fair point. Give it to me then, and here's some money for the rest. Alright, let's talk to Father again quickly. Um, about the yeah, things you wanted. Time. I, um... Actually, there's one thing I forgot. Just give me a moment. Get a move on, we have to... What's the sword fighting lesson got to do with anything? We don't have to go there to finish. Finish the quest, I don't think. Have to have a look. What did you actually do in Kuttenberg? Oh, all sorts. You had to be able to put your hand to anything if you wanted to make a living. But I was never far from iron. I'd like to see Kuttenberg sometime. I'll take you there one day, never fear. It's a beautiful city. But in the end, you'll learn the best places here by the Sassel. We've kind nobles, fertile land, and plenty of everything. And do you know Sir Radzig well? We've known each other long enough. Okay, done. Right, yeah, we'll call that the end of episode one, I think. We um, got all the stuff that he wanted, so he should be able to finish that sword now. Um, let's go and see if Mum's out the front. She might be able to help us a little bit, because um, we're in an need of attention I think Ma Oh now already done this so we'll just skip Very through what they're saying you ought to learn to do Thanks Ma Thanks Ma Good as new So we go back inside Can we actually sleep that's our bed there isn't it well, that's where he was sleeping I think Not much of a bloody bed Uh, yep, not much of a bed anyway, to be honest. Anyway, as I said, we'll call that end of episode one. We'll come back for episode number two. I'm hoping we've um, finished the quest yet. I know, we've got to finish the sword fighting lesson, so we'll do that next episode anyway, because, um, yeah, it's going to, we've already gone a fair way 
through we're already up to an hour so hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you did as always smash that like button leave a comment let me know if you want to see more of this series um and if you want to help out the channel make sure you like and comment that helps me out a lot and also share as well on the social media whether it's twitter or facebook or whatever you want to do it's been Bruno's Gaming thanks for watching we'll see you again soon